One week ago today, San Antonio police had responded to 62 homicide cases. Soto would be the 63rd case so far this year. Compare that to the end of May last year when San Antonio police listed 61 homicide cases at that time. One nonprofit teaming up with local police officers in hopes of connecting with the kids who grow up where gun violence lives. As the night team's Patty Santos tells us, it's the first positive interaction some of these kids have ever had with police officers. The communities these children come from, they've never had a positive encounter with the police when they, they see the red and flashing lights and somebody laying in the ground. But today could change things for some of these San Antonio kids and even adults. And that's what I've been doing, saying a personal thank you, because we will give them the head roll, but we will not say and acknowledge when someone's doing something positive. Diane Ross says this walk a mile in my shoes community event has softened her view on officers. And that's exactly what it's intended to do, says coordinator Troy Smith, a retired police officer. Both sides have gotten so much stress and been under so much pressure that it's just very hard for anybody to trust anybody. Local community groups working with the police union invited 400 students for a match, hoping they can find common ground. By them working on the lanes with each other, they'll be able to die, have that dialogue with, on a one-on-one -on -one basis. And Smith knows one game, one event isn't going to make a winning strike, but he knows it's a winning start. We know we need the citizens' trust, and this is one way of bringing that gap together. Are you ready? Yeah! Between the playful jeers and cheers, connections were made. I do understand a little bit better of what it means to, to be a cop. And this is the first of many events Smith and the nonprofits are planning to put together this summer. He's actually asking the city of San Antonio to support a four-year pilot program that would bring more events like this to our community. Steve?